Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about the states of matter and introduce the states of matter triangle. If you take a look at this triangle, you will see the different states. And you will see that matter can move from a liquid to a solid, solid to a gas, or go the other way around. This movement is a physical change, not a chemical change. And you also notice a plus or minus sign. This indicates if heat is added or if heat is taken away. Let's start at liquid and move in a clockwise fashion, then we'll go the other way around. Whenever you move from a liquid to a solid, this is called freezing, and heat is subtracted. If you will notice, you have solid ice now. Because it once was liquid, heat was taken away, and now it's solid. Now when you go from a solid to a gas and skip the liquid phase, that is called sublimation and it needs heat in order to do this. Underneath this smoke is a bar of solid bar of dry ice. When you move from a gas to a liquid, this is called condensation and heat is removed. The water vapor in the air hits the glass, the glass is cold, and it becomes a liquid. Now let's go in the opposite direction. When you go from a liquid to a gas, this is called evaporation. It requires heat. And you will notice the water is being heated and is evaporating. When you go from a gas to a solid, this is called deposition. And it needs heat removed. In this picture, the water vapor in the air hits the cold glass and instantly becomes a solid. And finally, if you go from solid to liquid, this is called melting and it requires heat. And you will see that this solid block of ice is now becoming a liquid and you can see it drip away. So take a look at the triangle of states of matter. You can see the different states and if it needs energy or heat or not. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.